Tonight is Hillary Clinton campaigns in Nevada. NBC News has learned the FBI has begun its analysis of the private email server she used while serving as Secretary of State. And we've also learned this week a federal judge in Washington is set to hold a hearing on another issue touching on this email controversy surrounding a well-known member of Clinton's inner circle. Our justice correspondent Pete Williams has late details. The FBI's forensics experts are now examining the server once located in Hillary Clinton's New York home, the device that hosted her private email account. Two sources familiar with the process say analysts are optimistic they can recover at least some data, even though they've determined, as was previously disclosed, it was wiped clean when the account was deactivated. The FBI is examining whether any government secrets were improperly sent or received on the private server, which was not a classified system. It was never designed to be secure. It was designed to be a way of sharing information, not protecting information from being shared. I do want to be the champion for The emails have been Americans a stubborn political issue, a nearly daily distraction you. for her. Just yesterday, the State Department said 305 emails have been flagged for further review to see if they contain classified information. On Thursday, a federal judge holds a hearing on a lawsuit touching on the email controversy involving Huma Abedin, a key Clinton campaign advisor constantly at the candidate's side. She was also a top aide to Secretary Clinton at the State Department and had an account on the private email server. A watchdog group that sued to get details of Abedin's government contract has expanded its lawsuit, demanding a search of the Clinton emails for answers. I think they are dragging their feet. I think that they are engaged in some form of gamesmanship, legal gamesmanship and they're being less than frank and forthcoming. Campaigning today in Las Vegas, Mrs. Clinton was asked about it. Well, I do now. I mean, in retrospect, what was supposed to be convenient has turned out to be anything but convenient.